Hello guys, my name is Fox, I'm looking for 9 of our Crusader Kings 2 Horse Lord series. Let's continue. So, in the previous episode we finished the conquest of couple more provinces for our uh, new, uh, newly created tribe in this uh, Tibetan region and now we are uh, going to uh, revoke a couple more holdings from these guys who are technically our vassals, but I don't want them to be my vassals, I want to have their holdings uh, to increase... Uh, the strength of my tribe, because apparently it is a sink and it's probably gonna affect our uh, succession, so I don't want to lose in the succession, that's why I'm gonna be trying to do this. We could settle, could not burn to the ground anything quite yet, and also on that their titles might pass from your realm, Khan Bashmal the wolf, uh, why is it so? Hmm, I don't know, but okay. Our population cap is 26,000 again. Even though it was less a second ago. Like 19k. And I don't think I got any more new holdings. Actually, I got Fergana, I guess. And we're about to get some more, like... Give me a summer can please. Uh... I'm probably not gonna be taking Barony yet. Oh, he's gonna refuse. And does it mean that he's gonna rebel? Probably yes. But I think we could put down his rebellion relatively easily. You should not be uh, arbitrary. And yeah, considering that we already have troops right in his capital, he's not gonna be able to refuse. Also, why are you not starting to siege? That's better. Oh, you managed to spawn your troops in the different counties, that's interesting. Also, these guys have a Manichian Uprising. And you're probably not gonna be able to fight it off. Well, that's cool. Okay. So, I'm just gonna be sitting. Actually, it's gonna take a lot of time to siege it. But even if I... Why am I losing war score? They're controlling all the holdings. Yeah, not for a uh, long time. Uh, even if I were to destroy his army, I don't think it's gonna give me much war score because we only have 400 troops. And also we have a new sun, okay? You could be uh, honest, it is fine. And now we're losing the succession again. Okay, I understand nothing in here. Mm, okay, if this guy is set as my successor, let's go and give him some honorary titles, so uh, he's gonna receive at least some more monthly prestige. Point 0.2, point 0.3, point, point 0.4, okay, you're gonna become Ishad, I'd have to uh, give salary to you, but at least you're gonna start receiving some prestige, and it would be also great if I could set you away as a mercenary. And my manpower is actually about uh, already close to the 500. Also, we probably need to split these guys and go and actually destroy his army before they're gonna be able to siege anything down. Because considering the amount of defense we have, they're gonna be able to siege even with 400 troops. Because all of our stuff is undefended. Okay, the battle won, only 3%. Actually, 15% war score, and we're losing... Why this sink is not uh, showed as taking war score anymore, as the rebels control all their holdings? Why it's not uh, showed with a different color? That's strange. But okay. Uh, hostile due to someone who is raiding us. And now who the hell is that? Doesn't matter. We lost our steward, let's get a new one, and you're gonna be trying to collect some more tribute from this guy. Okay, so a couple more sieges should... Uh, why the hell is you who uh, revelled? It probably uh, looks like a new mechanic or something, because when I... Uh, previously... When you sit on their capital, 
uh, they had no chance to spawn troops, but now they are spawning them in uh, neighboring provinces. Even though they have no control over them, so... I don't know why the hell is it happening, but... Yeah. Maybe just to prevent such thing as I did, revoking uh, his title while, while I'm sitting, uh, sitting in his capital. But, yeah, it's still not gonna help him much, I think. Mm, should we even follow this 100 troops? Probably not. When we're gonna finish the second siege, I think it should be enough for him to surrender. Okay, we have 100%. Let's go and enforce demands. And now I could freely revoke the title because he's in prison, I think. And because he's a traitor, no one would object. Great. Give me a summer camp, please. Uh, oh, I already did it. Great. So now we have eight. And the baroness and stuff I'm not gonna be touching, at least for now. And let's go for the Kutal. I want to have at least the same amount of holding as this guy have, so maybe it's gonna help with my succession, because I'm already getting really old, and uh, if I'm gonna lose a succession, it's probably gonna be game over for me. Oh, may now maybe, so please try not to rebel, it's a little bit annoying to fight with you. Okay, you gave me Kotal, good job, now we have 9, okay, everything looks fine, and our vassals don't want to have any more holdings, could pillage some stuff. I'm gonna continue with the Osh, because we're gonna soon probably burn it to the ground. And also, if we wait a little bit more time, looks like we're getting uh, 50 gold instead of 10, so we probably should be trying to do this a little bit more. Also, now we should have enough manpower to send one of our sons as mercenary, yes. Okay, let's send this one, because he looks a lot better than the rest, so let's go and do this. Send you away as a mercenary. I could recall you in like five years. Oh god damn it. I hope I could survive for five years. Actually, we are still stressed and still surviving. It would be great if someone uh if I were to get the event to relieve my stress, but oh we also could ransom our vassals from the prison. And I think it's gonna be a decent idea. So you're gonna get ransomed, and also we have tons of gold, which we probably should spend on something, at least upgrading our capital. Trade post limit plus one. Hmm. <coughs> Why would I need to have trade post limit? I'm not a freaking republic. Uh, clan sentiment plus... What is clan sentiment, actually? Uh, I have no idea. What's this thing affecting, but okay. Garrison size, fourth level, Cultur cultural technology. Let's spend on something that's relatively cheap. So, okay, we finished with all of our revoking in there, I assume. Yes. Now, we could get, ba uh, get back to this place. Giving some more power to uh, this tribe, the tribe of Muji. And we need a new chancellor because our son is now a mercenary. Okay, we're gonna be improving our relations with whom? This guy have 64 only, so yeah. He's gonna be the one. How is our factions looking? No factions currently, great. And also we could pillage some lands in here, which I am going to do. Uh, we're gonna pillage... Jaws gun, could I do this? No. Munjan or Afra Siap? Oh, it's in the, in, uh, in the different provinces. Okay, fine with me, actually. A hundred gold for nothing. Is very welcome. And we are must wealth. Oh, I, I forgot that we had this. Uh, that we had this ambition. Okay, so now that we have that much gold, we probably could upgrade our army even more 
Oh. Apparently we've... We're on our manpower cap. And... How could I get more? I really don't know. Also, let's set this to be reinforced at full speed. Okay, that's unfortunate. Uh, you cannot create this court. Your maximum manpower size has been reached. And how could I increase? Maximum manpower base is 0.25. Current popular population base. Blah, blah, blah. Modifiers building in Alma Geek. Where is... What is Alma Kik? Alma Lik. What is Alma Lik? It's not my capital. Mm. Okay, I have no idea. Oh, whatever. Oh! Max manpower is uh, dropped because uh, they're maintaining the mercenary band. Okay, I got it then. So, okay, let's get back just to conquer an RC, tour them, and then uh, looking what we're gonna do with the rest. Croron probably, as I already said, could become a decent enough... Uh... Oh, Nandin is not my tributary anymore. It's unfortunate. We're actually losing all of our tributaries. And Anxi is not as well. God damn it. And now they're being attacked by... No, they are attacking... The wolf. What? How the hell you're... Wait a second. Okay, the war is already finished. I don't know. I don't understand anything. And yeah, this guy's not my tributary anymore. Which is unfortunate. And our income is actually kinda sparse right now. So we should work on this, but first of all, we're just gonna conquer RC. For this new tribe. So we have 9-9 nine, nine in there. We are still losing the, the succession. But at least our son is now a mercenary, so he's getting free prestige per, per month, which could help him get enough prestige to win the succession uh, for me. If only I'm gonna survive long enough for him to come back. So... Mm -hmm. Okay. Also, we could get ourselves some more lands to get some more potential population. Because this guy still have more potential population than we could have. For some reason, a reason, even though we have uh, more pro or the same amount of provinces, you should not be content. Mm. What is this flex? These guys are attacking uh, RC in the conquest of RC. Oh, it's mine war. And attacking uh, boar in the co conquest of Kaisel. <coughs> I'm sorry. Okay, so these guys. Keep expanding by taking Otokin. Okay, that's actually fine. Someone should do this. Uh, so you usurped, you usurped Kaisel. And you've gr grown a little bit. Okay. So these guys could... Uh, these two guys still could grow on their own. I'm gonna help this little guy. And my tribe I'm gonna be also growing by myself. Okay. Looking fine. Hunts and parties has been built in the capital. Let's go and see if you have anything for uh, uh, for more maximum manpower. It would be actually really great. Nomad attacks, armies, defense, points, sentiment, and no technology. Missing place for the different clans in the Nomad realm to discuss. So, clan sentiment is means... Uh, Clan sentiment is... Uh, yeah, it is their opinion. Okay. And this guy wants more grazing lands. Are you for real? We have the most grazing lands 
in this freaking empire and you still want more. You're filthy bastard. Okay. We could pillage Osh. Yes, please. Actually, let's wait a little bit. Maybe we could get uh, 50 gold from them instead of 10. And we're gonna wait on this ones as well. Uh, okay, we need to finish the siege of RC. And... Yeah, that's about it. Oh, yeah, I forgot about the building in here. We're not gonna get more clan sentiment because our opinion with most of them are already fine. Oh, this guy only have plus 35. Okay, let's try to improve it. Why is it so, actually? It's not a counselor. And the rest is fine. Okay. Uh, let's get you here. And Ars is about to get done, and I think it should get us to 100%. And now what the heck is this siege about? About... <laughs> what? Much raiders? So... This clan is pillaging the other clan in the same realm. Really? Is it... I thought it's not possible. Okay, that's weird, but... I'm gonna finish with RC. And clans want more land. Uh, oh, so if I would have to... If I would have more... Provinces than the other guy in here, they're gonna start... Be pissed about it. Okay, but I'm still planning to give it to the other guy, so whatever. You're gonna get Karasher, not Barony, but County with... Uh, oh, first of all, first of all, I'm gonna pillage it. Then, let's go and check this. Okay, Osh now is 50 gold, that's awesome. This place is 50 gold too. And this place is 50 gold, okay. So I need to wait a little bit more to get 50 instead of 10. And... Crusher now should become yours. County of... This place, including lower titles. And we could also invest in the economical technology. Uh, no effects. Adopt Republicanism, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Local build cost modifier. Couldn't really affect me in much ways because... Because of reasons. It only could affect me when... Or, or after I'm gonna settle down. I guess I'm gonna get like... Castle infrastructure, whatever. Also, what is this thing? Trade post limit, zero out of zero. Okay. So you're having this lens now. I also could give you a room key, but I'm not gonna do it quite yet before I'm gonna be able to get myself some more lens. So we finished with this one. Now could we make a uh, make current to our tributary right away? Uh, we probably could and we probably should. So let's go and declare this war right away. You're gonna be our tributary and this time you're gonna just call all of our vassals in. Oh shoot, of course you raised mercenaries on what or whatever is that. Okay, let's wait on our, on our vassals to gather their troops. 5,000 in here. Uh, are you sure you're gonna be able to deal with it? You might actually, it's on the desert, so no uh, defense bonuses for them. And they also have low, lower morale, so yeah, you're gonna be able to crush it, thanks a lot. 75% immediate war score. And actually a couple, couple more battles probably gonna be enough for us to just enforce demands right away. Uh, no duels. Okay, come on, move quicker please. 91%. Yeah, let's go and try to 
snipe some more of these little armies. And it should give me enough war score uh, to finish the war even without the sieges. Because it's a little bit more time efficient, I think. Okay, you're willing to run away, but we could easily follow you into the Turtam Pillage Osh again. But I'm gonna wait to get 50 gold if possible. Also, we finished upgrading here. Let's get ourselves, I don't know, ship. More nomad techs, why not? Are we getting, are we receiving at all taxes from nomads? Hmm, let me see. So, Kenneth Yugur demands nomadic tax. Uh, current population, oh! Interesting. Unused manpower, current population. Okay, I didn't know, but apparently it's gonna be great to have. Also, what the hell are... Who the hell are you? Burstein clan, who is situated somewhere here, are now pillaging my lands in there. Uh, really? Actually, I could loot this baroness, I don't really care about... Actually... Uh, why the hell I have this as my top holding if I control it uh, directly by myself? I don't know. Probably because there's no, not enough space in here. So, are we going to be able to uh, capture you in time also? How's our concubines? You're 43, you're 45. Time for you to go away. And for us to get someone new from the prisoners. Beat. You're a male. You're 17. Great. You're going to be our concubine. And you're going to like it. So. Um, God damn it. 99%. Really? What's the problem? Now it just... It is what it is. Okay. Are you guys going to get this army? Oh no. We lost our second... Warhorse, let's get a new one. What is that? Choose a Warhorse. You're gonna be a Dragon the Third. Oh, how's our son looking? Now you have zero prestige. Okay, at least you're starting to get into the positive side, which is great. And when I'm gonna be able to re recall you, I don't know. It's not showing anywhere. But... Okay. Actually, does this mercenary company actually exists? Yeah, so they look like uh, they are moving around and pillaging stuff in real world. They're not just on the paper. So that's kind of cool. Also, we are really... Uh, over our time limit, so I should be finishing this episode in here, and we're gonna finish our war with the Croran in the next episode, I guess. So, if you enjoyed watching this, you could leave a like, if you want to see more, you could subscribe, and if you want to leave a comment, you should definitely do it, and I would answer you as soon as I could. See you later, guys. Bye-bye.